All right. All righty. We're doing a separate stream. Um, I'm only going to be streaming this for two hours, just so you all know. Uh, I'm not going to be really doing this too crazy. Now, the reason why I am doing this is because I got this for some of my friends. Uh, some of my friends don't play Cold War. So I'm thinking, okay, let me just play the campaign. Now, I will say right now in advance, I did watch tidbits of the campaign. Just just tidbits, not, not the whole thing, you know. So we are going to be doing the campaign. We're just going to play right through it. Um, I'm not assuming we're going to be able to finish this throughout this week, but we'll see. Recruit, regular, hardened for seasoned players looking for a bigger challenge. Enemies are more dangerous. Your skills will be pushed to the limit. Realism, the most challenging experience. Enemies are lethal with deadly accuracy. The ultimate test of skill. I feel like hardened would be my thing. I'll do hardened. Do not be. Oh my gosh, this going to be demonetized. Oh, yeah. No, skip it. No. I, I have to skip you sure it. sure we can trust the police, Adler? This guy's done more for less. He'll look the other way. I had to skip it. I'm sorry. Just copyright and all that. Damn, it's been a while since I played a COD campaign. Glad you could join us, Hans. You remember me. We cleared a move on the target. Kasim is in his apartment, but he's well protected. I can keep my men out of the area for 15 minutes. I hope you brought an army. We brought enough. Pleasure doing business with you, Hans. Come on. Woods is itching for a dust dump. We don't want to let him down. Okay. Damn it, it's been so long since I played a COD campaign. <laughs> the fucking toilet. Hey mate. Party favors are in the trunk. Oh, the voice isn't that bad. Nah, I'm an AK-74 person. Dipshit probably thinks he's safe. That piece of trash is a lot of things. But safe ain't one of them. Oh, they see it. Do we really need to take this son of a bitch alive, Adler? Kazim has info we need. Everyone else can take a powder. I feel like we're about to get in a gunfight in just a moment. Apartment's just up ahead. Hans only bought us 15 minutes. We need to hit Kasim hard and fast. Let's go. Let's help him bring in the new year. Light him up, Mason. Go, go, go! Holy shit. Okay. All right, we're doing this. We're doing this. Kasim's headed up the Oh shit. I saw I was shooting at him. Yup, yup, yup. Yup, got the bastard, all right. Okay, before 
before we do anything else, hold on. What's this auto aim shit? Hold on. Where is this? <laughs> Fuck out. Holy shit, okay, that's a bad idea. Accidentally fucking shot him. Getting his ass. I oh, didn't. He was shooting at us, so that's why. I Twice already. You're up, Mason. All right, come on, get up. Wait, wait, oh. Oh. wait, wait, wait. Oh. I, I, I just handle the money. I have no idea where Arashi is. I don't think you understand the situation. Ah! You Americans have rules. You have rules. You took hostages. The rules changed. Talk or you're going over. Wait, wait, wait. He's in Turkey. He's meeting someone in Trap Zone Airfield tomorrow night. Uh, Who's the rush meeting with? Uh, oh, I swear, I swear, I don't know. They only communicate with coded messages. You're coming with us. I told you he would talk. You're coming with us. This is not. Oh. All right, let's load him up. We'll find his voice soon enough. Let me know if you need some help. Look Buy the book, capture Kasim and Hivadi, and nowhere left to run. We're bringing you a present. He's in Trap Zone 13. 18 hours later. Kasim is out of the picture. How long before we get Harash? The team arrived in Turkey a few hours ago. They should be in position shortly. Here we are. Airfield's just a bad. Hey, he rocking the headband too. Let's go find this shithead. Always rocks the headband. That also reminds me when I saw the trailer for his fucking like him being in the wheelchair for like Black Ops Six. I was like, holy fucking shit! What? Oh shit! Priorities. I couldn't believe it. Ooh. Oh! 
Oh, he is so fucking lucky. Oh, it's woods. Oh, that's great. Let's, let's move. Let's move. Let's move. Let's move. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck off. Get in the fucking car. Get in the fucking car. Okay, that was an RPG. That was an RPG. Bet. All right, let's do it. Oh shit. Okay, okay, okay. Yup, that's what I'm trying to do. Oh, that was really close. That was really close. Oh shit, okay, okay. Oh my gosh. Holy shit. Oh, they're not alive. Kill him! Kill him! Oh. oh shit. Am I dead? Am I dead? How the fuck did you make it out of that? Just uh, unscathed. Uh, you should have freed the hostages when you had the chance. Uh, hostages. It was never about the hostages. Uh, his plan is already underway. Uh, you won't be able to stop him this time. Stop who? Perseus. Bullshit. Perseus is dead. Dead? <laughs> All this time and you didn't even know. <laughs> Perseus will watch the West back. Hudson don't want to hear about this. Let's sweep the tarmac for survivors and get to Langley. Who the fuck is Perseus? Oh, we'll find out soon. Nineteen forty-three. Detailed information from the Manhattan Project was stolen from Los Alamos by the Russian spy known as Perseus. Nineteen sixty-eight. Vietnam War. Viet Cong soldiers, orchestrated by Perseus, attempted to steal an American-made nuclear bomb from a U.S. firebase. Five days ago, while on a mission, we acquired intel that Perseus is in play again and planning an attack on the West. Perseus. The CIA's analysts consider him to be the single largest threat to the free world. Mr. Hudson, we're all aware of Perseus. We're also aware he's more myth than fact. I mean, damn, this cutscene looks so Personally, I think he's nothing more than the Russian boogeyman. General Haig, allow me to introduce the man best suited to respond to that. CIA clandestine special officer Russell Adler. He's one of the few people who even come close to capturing Perseus. Uh, Mr. Adler, why should we take this Perseus threat seriously? You don't have to, sir. <laughs> yeah, then a lot of innocent people are gonna die. Why do you say that? Sir, every time Perseus has come into play, it's shifted the balance of the Cold War. After 13 years of silence, if he's active, something big is going to happen. Something that will affect the free world. Sir, sir, Mr. 
Mr. President. Sir. Mr. President. Mr. President, this is Jason Hudson and Russell Adams. I know their names. Who do you think approved their last mission? Is the threat real? Yes, sir, we believe it is. Can you stop Perseus? We can, sir. I've already submitted the requisition for my team. Sir, their requests are highly irregular. Most likely illegal. If the press gets a hold... What the hell are you talking about? You know who we are? Every mission we go on is illegal. Sergeant <laughs> Woods, plausible deniability is the backbone of our work. Al, we're talking about preventing an attack on the free men and women of the world. Give Mr. Adler whatever he wants. Gentlemen, you've been given an important task. Protecting our very way of life from a great evil. There is no higher duty. There is no higher honor. And while few people will know of your struggles, rest assured, the entire free world will benefit. I know you won't fail us. What's the quote? The people may not remember it, but the world will. This is Hudson. How long until we have a lead on Perseus? They're about to get started. Adler's in West Berlin. He should be at the safe house soon. Do you trust him? <laughs> I'm not the one you should be asking, Black. What about his team? It's a strong group. He chased down Sims, Azalei, even pulled some strings to get Helen Park from MI6. We'll get them Mason and Woods soon. I'm not so sure about Park. She and Adler have that business from before. Of course he wants her there. And the new one. Well, well, don't get me started. That's the one we need to keep our eyes on. Oh shit, Jesus. Okay, there we go. Fucking hell. Oh! Oh, we're doing all this. Oh, first name. And the... Uh... <laughs> Last name. Nightwish. All right. Um. What's this one? Place of birth. North America. Skin tone. Uh. Probably that. Gender. Obviously, I'm a man. So there's that military background. I would say XKGB. I'm gonna say XKGB, that's what I would do. Um, psychological profile. Oh boy. <sighs> Oof, what would I be? I know for sure I would have been Lone Wolf. Dependable, damage taken when stationary, reduced by 30%, relentless, methodical. Calm under pressure. Oh boy, you'd be surprised on how calm under pressure I was would be. Survivor and health increased by twenty five percent. Aggressive behavior. Tormented. Reliable. Fearless. Professional. When using aim down sight speed. I feel like it would be Lone Wolf. I'm gonna do Lone Wolf because that's just how I am. And then I got a second one. Okay, so. Fearless, reliable, aggressive behavior, survivor. <sighs> Calm under pressure. That's what I would have. All right, confirm. Once you confirm, you will no longer be able to change it. Bet. I am XKGB. Bell, welcome to West Berlin. We've got a job to do. Ender Bell Nightwish. Mark. What's Berlin? Bell. Let's get started. There's been a surge in Russian chatter in the last 48 hours. CIA. And Holy shit, what is this? Hold on. Is my FOP fucked? Hold on. Holy fuck, it just looks so weird to me. Hold on, is there a way to change that? Hold on, give me one second. 
Ray tracing, field of view. My field of view is already 120. Fucking hell. Okay. DOD it looks so weird. Source. I don't know why. Anything substantial. So far, there are no leads on Perseus. MI6 has come up empty-handed as well. And we'll have to start somewhere. So we're going back here. Vietnam, 1968. One of our closest encounters with Perseus. Shit. Some part of me always knew that mission wasn't done with us. Pull up everything we've got on the attack at Denang and run it past Clark. She'll cross-reference it with MI6. We're looking for code names, encrypted transmission, Russian activity with NVA, anything that could be a lead. Got it. Bell, this is where you come in. As ex-KGB, it was a risk to bring you on, but we needed to think like them. And we need that mindset again. Head to the evidence board. We'll retrace our steps through Denang. Anything that could give us a lead on Perseus. Use the evidence board to select the next mission. I talked to him. Bell, you're looking a little pale. You up for this? Never been better. I'm struggling to recall Denang. I don't. I don't know. Denang was rough. Don't get soft like Sims. If we survive Vietnam, we can survive talking about Vietnam. Fair enough. To my shrink, Doc. Huh? What's up with the evidence board? We're placing key intel up there. One for each mission. Forming connections. I want a red line right to Perseus. Park seems familiar. You just met her yesterday, right? I don't know. Why don't you ask her? Maybe you two have a special rapport. Keep it professional, Bell. Of course I'm gonna keep it professional. Well, what do you think I am? How long has this place been in use? The safe house? I've done time here before. Years back. This go round? Just a few days now. As for Czar, he can't get enough of safe houses. Okay. Why well, talk about the Nang mission? It'd be good for Park to hear it from us firsthand. Maybe we have overlooked something. So you've worked with Lazar before? We've done some jobs together. Good guy. You'll like him. He keeps things light. Okay. Don't be a stranger. I won't be. Now. Yo, Park, what up? You have nothing to say. What are you looking at? I'm going to need to process some of these old negatives. You can hit that whenever you're ready. The dark room's mostly functional. What are you looking at? A couple more deliveries to finish it up. What are you looking at? Okay, I can't talk to you for some reason. What about you, Lazar? What up? Bell. Burger Town. <laughs> this is actually a thing. How long have you been with the CIA? Working with the CIA over a decade. Damn. On their actual payroll? Going on about five years. That's a long ass time. I was born in DC. Parents moved to Israel when I was a kid. Dual citizenship has its advantages. Israel? Yup. I landed in the Israeli Defense Forces out of university. Did a tour there. After that, How long the Mossad. Is a tour? That's when I first started working with the CIA. And occasionally, I'm boss man Adler over there. Do you know of Perseus before this mission? You probably know more than me. I guess it's something the top brass wanted to keep to themselves. I hear you enjoy safe houses. <laughs> this one is luxury. Fresh air, lots of room. Try being squeezed into a 500 square foot shithole with five other people. A long drive into Berlin is worth it. Believe me. Mm. Enough talk. All right. Sims. Heavy. Hell yeah. One sec. Oh, you're doing that. What's down here? What's down here? What's going on Just over like here? It's, what's his name? That guy back in Vienna. You know. Come on, baby. Let there be like good. I need to move a little. How's the shoulder? Uh. Oh. Oh. Okay, is Park available now? There we go. How are things, Bell? 
Um, you look familiar. Have we worked together before? You and I. It's entirely possible. I have a long collaborative history with other intelligence services. Our paths have likely crossed at some point. Anything I can help you with? Well, I'm keen to hear about your time in Indochina. So close to Perseus. Uh, what do you know of Perseus? Not nearly as much as I'd like. I have experience with others like Perseus. They're all chess players. I enjoy predicting the next move. Hmm. Interested in Vietnam stories? In this case, quite. I understand you may have first-hand knowledge that could help us. I don't think I've talked about Vietnam in years. It must be difficult, Bell. I can't claim to have experienced what you have. Perhaps going over it again could be therapeutic. <laughs> yeah, I have we'll talk doubt again it. soon. Anything else around here? What the hell? There's a computer over here. An old ass computer. What the hell is this place? What the hell? Uh huh, okay. That was um, interesting. What's over here? Even anything over here? Probably not. What the fuck? This is watching me? Okay. Anything back here? What does it say? Clinical record. Uh, can I unlock it? Oh, I can't unlock it. Fuck, can't unlock it. That's interesting. Seriously, there's something down here. I don't know what the fuck it is, though. What's in there? Man, I sure shit do not know. Whoa, what is it? What do you want? Alright, let's go. The evidence board. Use the evidence board to select the next mission, replay previous missions, or examine evidence. Duh, duh, duh. Okay. <laughs> Wait, where's the evidence? Nowhere left to run. There's only one. The evidence was okay. Cause seem have really 1911 from Webb's shipment. Bullet extracted from Osh Russia's target as Russell Adler, Frank Woods, and Lex and May. Victim's uh, chest cadaver was using 1911 from the illicit weapons shipment it was loaded on a nearby plane, and then his glasses. Sketch of Cassim's body's apartment. Wait, what the fuck? Huh, wait, I could rotate it? I didn't even know about that. I didn't even know about that. Okay. That's interesting. Very interesting. Yeah, I don't think there's a whole lot of like stuff I could find. I don't even think there is. Nope. Okay. I could even lost the mission again if I want to, but I'm not really gonna do that. A fractured jaw. During an investigation into the Soviet activity, Vietnam Russell Adler's SOG team assisted a U.S. firebase against a surprise Viet Cong attack by Perseus. Perseus wanted a hidden military asset that had been placed while in the firebase rip cord. The asset, the asset, what the asset? The asset was part of the clandestine, ill-fated Operation Fractured Jaw. Paul Russell Adler and Lawrence Sims shared joy, shared suffering. After Lawrence Sims graduated from Rochester Institute, uh, Russell and Russell Adler's Mac V S O G team in Vietnam, where he immediately became one of Adler's favorite cohorts. He was calendar 1967. Delta deployments. A lot of stuff. Journalism. The events denying during January 1960 revealed an embarrassing vulnerability in the fractured job plan. It was immediately scrapped before any additional damage could be done. 
Fracture jaw nuclear device. The fortunes of US military in Vietnam declined. Senior military officers, including General William Westmoreland, began to enact a top secret plan the deployment of tactical nuclear warheads in Vietnam. Perseus learned of this plan, codenamed Fractured Jaw, as well as the storage location of one of the firebombs sent into the country. Lawrence Sims Survival Knife. One morning in the early January 1968, MACV SOG operator Lawrence Sims left Denang Air Base with USAF Darren Cop for a routine recon mission. After experiencing mechanical difficulties, their chopper touched down in a jungle near clearing 15 miles outside the base. While looking for assistance, they were ambushed by Viet Cong and forced to flee into the jungle. Cop was killed in combat. Sims, ammo exhausted, took ca Cop's knife and circling the, circle the clearing per perimeter, and he managed to take out three soldiers by hand before reinforcements arrived and secure the malfunctioning cho chopper. Sims never parted with a knife after that incident and now hangs from the board as a good luck charm. Alright, let's off the mission. I don't know what the fuck I'm about to get myself into. Alright, Bell. We're going back to Vietnam. First time Perseus pinged our radar. It was late January 68. We were a joint CIA SOG task force embedded within the 3rd Marine Regiment near Da Nang. SOG was there to sniff out Soviet activity. Word had it Russian operatives were active in the region. Perseus had no known presence in Vietnam. That changed at Da Nang. Somehow Perseus knew about Operation Fracture Jaw. Fracture Jaw? That one sure went sideways. We launched out of Camp Haskins. Yeah, I'll never forget that shit. Good. We want those memories. No details too small. A face, a name. We're looking for anything that can lead us to Perseus. This feels like looking for a needle in a haystack. In a field of haystacks. Maybe, but that needle's somewhere. Remember, we had a job to do. Fracture jaw. That one sure went sideways. Bell, it's time to wake up. It's great time. Great time. I don't want to get up. I want to sleep and be lazy. What's this? Frags? What's that? Oh. Love, wait, why do I need to? Power. Am I going to just start shooting? Get up. Get up, Peterson. Get up. Ooh, a stoner. Give me that shit. Yep, just give me a second. Just looking around. I hope I don't get copyright for that. I swear. Is there an M60? Please tell me there's Welcome an M60. Welcome to another day in the life of Gosh, Camp Haskins. A little oasis in the middle of this godforsaken shitstorm. You're pretty safe here. Gonna remind me of that one mission. Um. Hey, butcher. How's the arm? Still hurts like hell, but at least I can move it. Hold on, I'll be right there in a moment. Hold on, give me a second. I just want to look around. But yeah, it's gonna remind me of uh, the Black Ops 1 mission. Where we have to defend against the uh, Viet Cong. Jesus, it was so fucking difficult on veteran. What does it say? Yo, Sims. Hey, Sims, you know reading that shit's gonna make you go blind. Yep. That's why I want it all up here. Bell, you're with Sims. Usually bring out the best in each other. We got a new assignment. FOB4 Ripcord is holding a vital asset. Charlie wants real bad. What kind of asset are we talking about? An what asset. You don't ask about. Ripcord has been taking a hell of a beating, so it's our job to secure the asset and get the fuck out. Relax, we got fast flyers providing combat air support for this mission. It'll be a walk in the park. Sure, totally. Headsets on. All birds check in when ready. Badger Niner 1, good to go. Badger Niner 2, clear to go. Badger Niner 3, oh, rotors up. 
Better not be copyrighted, sort of god. I think this might be copyright. I think this might be copyright. I might have to turn it off. Hold on. Hold on. Where's music volume? Hold on. I'm gonna have to turn that shit down. Hold on. Holy shit. How how far do I gotta go down? Oh man, Adler. Why do I get the feeling you? Okay, maybe maybe just a bit more. Oh god. Okay. I'll do like 25. About to give us some bad news. Cause you're a smart guy, Sims. But the news. I can't fucking hear it. Ugh, I'm sorry. Okay, do 40. This isn't bad. In fact, it could be very, very good. The asset this is as good as it's gonna, gonna get. Wait a little while. I don't want to get copyrighted. Taking a detour. And that's good because a source tipped us off that there may be a heavy hitter in town, a Soviet operative known as Perseus. Oh shit! Appreciate the enthusiasm, Sims. Actually, I'm sorry. I keep pausing. I'm sorry. I keep pausing. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, now we're good. Now we're good. Sorry. Just need to get myself a drink. A drink of coconut water. If our source is right, we could be looking at an Intel gold mine. Oh, fuck. Gosh damn. Ah, First time Perseus pinged our radar. Oh. Approaching the village now. Yeah, roger that. Moving to establish an LZ. RPG! Oh shit. An RPG. Yes. Uh oh. Yes, 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 I know. Keep pushing forward. You're getting close. Oh shit. Okay, hold on. Two, three, four, cook. Just 
falling down the stairs. Is he dead? He is not dead. He got lucky. Get moving. Careful with this shit. Switching spots. Fred looking for a needle in a haystack. You hear that? It's on you, Bell. Open the door. Adler, we confirmed it. Soviets on site. You sure? Well, I'm staring at two bodies that sure as hell don't look Vietnamese to me. <laughs> Bell, grab that comms log. I mean, he's not Let's wrong. Let's see who the fuck they've been talking to. Mission accomplished. We have the intel. Let's bug out. Good work. Hang on to that intel. We're coming in to pick you up. God, I love coconut water. Jesus, what would do for it? All right, let's go rejoin the armada and get this fucking asset. Call it. I heard it literally. To my fucking right. Badger nine or one, this is Ripcord. We are still under heavy fire. BC are breaching the perimeter. What is your status? We're inbound now, Ripcord. Get that asset ready for transfer. Roger that, nine or one. We'll keep the asset safe as long as we can. Gonna immediately Report get attacked out. as soon as we get on this chopper. Whoa, holy shit, what the fuck? Badger 9 or 1, in the air! BC are all over the mountains! No sense here! All targets are valid! Tear them up, Bill! Targets are hot! Holy shit, okay. All of them? I'm assuming that's all of them. Oh, who tried shooting at me? Who's that off in the distance? I know how to control a helicopter, Jesus. shooting Whoa. 
I'm all about the baby. <laughs> I know you fucking like this. Shit. <laughs> what am I on about? Patrick Hunter One, this is Ripcord. You need to push back the VC reinforcements before we're overrun. Oh Be shit! Advised, we have multiple birds in the air. Watch your fire. Enemies dug in all around the hillside. We don't have a hope in hell oh, shit, landing if we don't take out those positions. I didn't do too bad in this mission. I didn't do too bad. The base is still hot, so watch yourselves. Roger that, Ripcord. You Adler? Mac V Sog? Yeah, yeah, just hurry the fuck up already. Yes, sir. Oh, thank shit. You. Don't thank me. Thank Bell. He's the one who just sank up the fucking phone book full of Soviet intel. Let's go. Now. Godspeed, Commander. A fucking nuke? It's a failsafe. That's all you need to know. That desperate already? Not yet. Pretty much. We're pretty much that desperate. Oh shit! Uh oh. Oh no, he ain't living. He, yeah, he, he, he dead. He dead. Oh. And then we're dead. And then we're dead. Yep, that was it. Somehow Perseus knew. <laughs> that sounds like somehow Palpatine came back alive. I don't know why. It just made me laugh. Since Bell, you okay? Do I look okay? We're okay. Oh shit! Oh, there he goes. Let loose with that goddamn turret before we're overrun. Don't go around, don't go Oh shit! Oh shit! I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. I think I'm dead. Oh my gosh! How did I live that? All right, all right. Yup. Open the damn thing. Need air support. Bell, call it in. Grab a weapon. Keep them the fuck off us. Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, where's that air support? Oh, I'm gonna 
one second, I gotta reload. Tyler, please, for the love of God. Oh, I gotta get back. Oh, I'm dead, I'm dead. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I think it's dead. Holy shit! Oh, okay. Bell! Still with us? No. Napalm. Holy shit. Dude, I barely survived that. I you barely think we can survived call this it. a success, Sims? At least the nuke didn't go off. More importantly, we got intel on Perseus. Told you we had a job to do. It ain't done yet, not by a long way. Jesus. Yeah. How did the memory Four hours later. go? Well, to hear it from Adler, it's working. Bell remembered finding that encrypted intel in Vietnam and has almost finished decoding it. Anything useful in there? Some names, apparently. Possible leads. Park is trying to connect the dots. We don't have much time. Does the team know about our mishap in Berlin yet? No, but if it's connected to one of those names from Bell, they'll find out soon enough. You won't let that happen, Hudson. Don't say anything more than necessary. That's never been a problem for me. We finished analyzing Bro, the names Bell acquired Chinese. tonight. One in particular stands out. Anton Volkov. He's a Russian arms dealer working out of East Berlin. Admittedly, his connection to Perseus comes as a surprise. Ooh. We've got killer capture orders on Volkov. So if we can't get to Perseus, we'll get to his men. Close off his resources, force him out of hiding. Mason and Woods are still wrapping up business in Kiev. Which means Volkov is ours. Gear up, and we'll move out. Oh, okay. The question is, is that basement still open or no? What's in here? There's a phone in there. It is my strong preference that we attempt to capture rather than kill him. He holds answers to a great many questions. Your preference has been noted, Agent Park. Well, we'll see if we can capture him, because that's what I'm intending to do. Because I prefer to try and capture than kill, unless I'm just going to kill their ass. We'll talk on the drive, Bill. Okay. You? That until you found in Da Nang was a treasure trove. Uh, anything about Anton Volkov? Volkov? Born on the coast of Leningrad, never travels when the sun's out. He has impeccable taste in scotch and medieval torture devices. I think he'd love the UK. I plan on giving him a personal tour. Oh boy, that doesn't sound good. Have I, okay, have I found anything else in the intel other than the name? Will you tell me? After we dug it up, you spent two full hours decrypting everything inside. You seem to think Volkov was the name to pay attention to. I was decrypted all the intel myself. Are you feeling all right, Bell? That's one of the reasons we wanted you on this team. Not even the CIA's best cryptographers have been able to crack that dossier. You're special, Bell. But it also sounds like you need a nap. My pleasure. All right. What the fuck is this? Oh. Interesting. That's <laughs> some, some fucking sports. Oh, that's it. Anything back here? Nothing back here. Is there anything? What the fuck? 
What is this about? You have anything to say? Nice work producing that name, Bell. Did you ever see Perseus? Did I ever see his face? No. That photo on the board is all we have, and it's more yeah. than 20 years old. Yeah, you did. Handsome man. I hope the years Got weren't him. kind to him. I think you this one. You bound some checks again? Collections? Just talking about the phone. Here to entertain me. Uh, it seems like Vietnam defeated you. Are you being funny? Did we not just go through this? Look, I could say so many things right now. No. Forget about it. It's good. Okay, what do you know about Volkov? Shit. <laughs> I tried to track that motherfucker years ago when he went to Italy for a douchebag conference. He's slick. If you see him, Tell him Lawrence Sim says hello. Do you still operate in the field? Only when they tell me not to. This assignment, I'm mostly gonna run the shop. Whatever you guys need, I'll make sure you have it. You see, I got a list of connections longer than the Great Wall. Adler needs it, I can procure it. No exceptions. Okay. Come again. Oh, you just got done. I'm not gonna lie, my hair kind of bounces all over the place too. Hello. Especially when I'm walking. Uh, what if I ask for a flamethrower? Sure, I could get that. No problem. What about a recoilless rifle? Easy. I can have that in house by next week. How about a custom built twin engine attack helicopter? Mm, clever. But I wasn't joking earlier. You can actually give me a flamethrower. That's a hell of a request, but. Give me enough time, and I can have one parked outside. I'll take it all. Okay. Now, how you gonna pay for that? <laughs> Last I heard, Adler cuts the checks around here. Damn. Unless you got a suitcase full of cash, I'm gonna consider your request null and void. Damn. All right, fair enough. Yep. I didn't even know he could actually deadass give me a fucking um, flamethrower. That'd be interesting. the basement finally accessible or no nope still not okay good to know all right uh let's just do this fucking mission side mission hospital in addition to your next mission the optional side missions operation red circuit and operation chaos have been unlocked and are now available on the evidence where i definitely am gonna be doing the fucking which one operation chaos and operation red circus the next one would be brick in the wall okay i'm not gonna do that then Operation Chaos? So listen up. An ex-CIA operative named Robert Aldrich is gone. Oh, I was gonna let him fucking talk. Uh, it's gone rogue. Langsley believes this asshole is working with Perseus to assemble a spy ring inside U.S. borders. We recently acquired the encrypted floppy, floppy disk from one of his agents that we believe contains everything we need to know about his network. We can get to it. We know where Aldrich is and move on him anytime, but if we don't get into that disk first, we may nail... Alders, but leave his network intact. You may find some intel on our first mission that helped crack the code on the disk. Keep an eye out. What the fuck is this? We discovered Kasim carrying this coded message. We believe it's intended for the U.S. spy ring, but no one's been able to decrypt it yet. Show him how it's done. What the fuck? How? Robert Aldrich. No evidence. Coded message 1274 28 80 36 8. I have no idea how the fuck I'm gonna do this. Found in nowhere left to run. Floppy disk? What the fuck? If we decrypt the protection on this disk, we might be able to take down the entire spy ring. This is why we need you. Show us those skills. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do. We're gonna have to hold off on that one. Let's just start some mission. If you do not crack the security on the floppy disk before killing Robert Aldrich, his spy ring may escape. Fucking hell. So I have to actually decrypt it. Decrypt that. Okay. 
MI6 has spent the last year tracking a group of embedded Soviet agents within multiple European governments. These agents could be strategically positioned to set up a larger Soviet plan for Europe. During a recent operation, we acquired information about this group's structure. There are three unidentified key agents leading it, and their handler is the Soviet major Vadim Rudnik, a name previously connected to Perseus. We have Rudnik's position and can move on him. But if we don't first identify his three lead agents, we risk losing our chance to take all of the embedded agents down. Check out our list of suspects here. Special evidence you find on missions will help identify the three lead agents. I'd advise figuring out who they are before going after Rudnik. Interview suspects. How the fuck am I supposed to know this? Mark suspect. I can mark him. Jim Krieger. Five twenty one ninety three four. Okay, I don't even know. Examine evidence. According to CIA intelligence, Soviet Major Vadim Rudnik has collaborated with Perseus for several years now as they work to install agents within the political infrastructures of Europe. Rudnik is apparently the handler of these embedded operatives, so eliminating him will disrupt whatever long-term plans uh, Perseus has in mind. All right, um, I fucking don't know what to do. What evidence we have that from Emerson Black. This mission authorization telegram sent to other still Adler after from uh, Emerson Black, the deputy strategist within the CIA's decorate of operations. Traps in airfield and then the bloody dossier. That's really all we have. Okay. Some eminence. Eminence. Surveillance real of Franz Krauss. What if I just start the mission? What would happen? Oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus Christ. Volkov heads the Russian mob that moved into East Berlin once the wall went up in 61. This guy has connections to cartels throughout Europe and the Americas. Neutralizing him will not only hurt Perseus, but the global syndicate. He's a big fish. And here's our little fish, Franz Krauss. According to MI6, he's one of Volkov's information couriers. He has a drop with Volkov scheduled for tomorrow night. We'll infiltrate East Berlin via the U-Bahn. The ghost station on the other side of the wall has the access point we need. From there, we'll watch Krauss as he enters the city. Once Volkov shows his face, it's killer capture. I'm gonna capture, most likely. Because she says capturing is gonna be important, so we're gonna do that. They have Doritos. As soon as the train slows down, you and I'll jump off. Park, Lazar. Wait till the next station. Bell and I'll track down Kraus. All right. Train slowing down. Let's go to work. All right. That's All right. Time to pop. Here we go. Careful. East German guards still patrol these abandoned stations. Oh, sounds pistol. Patrol ahead. We can use a train to slip past. Move 
moving on the platform. Let's take them out quietly. Careful. Oh, it was really close. That works. Come good, on. Good thing the train can cover that up. I'm going up first. I really did almost fuck that up. Ich arbeite für die Bahn. Ich suche über meinen Ausweis. Das ist Sperrgebiet. Sie sind verhaftet. Runter auf den Boden. Halt, halt, halt. Beruhigen Sie sich. Now. Das ist zum... Nice work. Let's clean this up. Yep, I agree. Let's clean it up. Kraus should be coming through the checkpoint soon. Let's get to the rooftop. Bart, Lazar, we're almost in position. Copy that. Come on, this way. Yep. Careful of the spotlight. Down, I'll give him that. Damn, that is the Berlin Wall. Huh. Keep an eye on that check wall. Krauss will be coming through any time. Look for Kraus with your camera. My camera? Damn. Security's even tighter than usual. If they detain Kraus, he could miss his meeting with Falkov. Near the checkpoint. Man with the briefcase. Is that him? Man with the briefcase? Good job. That's our man. That's Kraus. I think he's gonna be detained. Oh, I guess not. On me. I don't know how I did that, don't ask. I have no idea. Park, Kraus just crossed the wall. What's your status? The and I are at the exfil point, awaiting your arrival. Roger that. Intel says Kraus and Volkov will meet at the bar across the street. Meet Hudson's contact inside. She'll have a blue umbrella. I'll stay out here and watch the street. So have a blue umbrella, okay. Very funny because they all have blue fucking umbrellas. You is it definitely not? Bell, find the contact. Yeah, I think I already found her. What the? Someone's not having a good time. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna let you have some privacy. Contact is a blue umbrella. Yeah, I know. I'm very fucking aware. Just looking around, man. Wie schön, dass Sie es geschafft haben. Kraus is at the table over my right shoulder. didn't reveal much. He said you're after Volkov. What do you know about the courier over there? The police are out in letters numbers tonight. What do you know about the courier over there? Kraus is ex-Stasi, so don't let his wholesome appearance fool you. The man is a killer. Ex-Stasi? The police are out in Lars numbers tonight. One of my informants was picked up in a random sweep just two blocks from here. The Stasi must assume they are more nearby. I see. I would ask a favor of you. He will not hold up under torture for long. We need him rescued. Or silenced. They're holding him here. I'll see what I can do. Danke schön. Rescue or silence the informant? Probably just rescue. How long will Volkov be in Berlin? Who knows? The man's like a ghost. I would guess no more than a day. Heads up, Bell. I think Volkov is walking in. Yep. That might be him. Oh, is Volkov? That's a good idea. Team, new plan. Meet outside Krauss's apartment. He's still our ticket to Volkov. <laughs> Stealth. Stay hidden to avoid detection. Enemies will be alerted when the icon's flashing red and the meter is full. Okay. <laughs> Ich wohne gleich Rally up with the Star Park without me. I'll update you when I can. See? Ich bleibe hier noch bei meinem Freund. Wir hatten ein paar zu viel in der Careful, Bell. The stars here are everywhere. Ich tue Ihnen nichts. Ich möchte nur ein paar Fragen stellen. Oh shit. Ist er weg? Vielen Dank. Ich bleibe, glaube ich, so lange hier, bis die Stasi weg ist. Oh, it's you. Okay, you're welcome. I didn't even know you were in, in here. Meet me in the building across from your current position. Keep a low profile. We already have enough trouble. Damn it, I thought I could get both of them, I guess not. I told you. 
I'm not trying to say I am. You, I've seen your picture. They're looking for you. I've been monitoring a, a nearby KJB field house. I, I don't know how they found me. I, I found everything by the book. Lay low, we'll be in touch. You were careless and can't be trusted. You were done for it. Lay low. Thank you for saving my life. I'll be waiting to hear from you. Oh, there's evidence. <laughs> Operation Chaos. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a... Subject 0710 has been... Go ahead. For, uh, I'll be fine. This is to our inter interrogation message, but a recent breakthrough has revealed some interesting intelligence. Under extreme duress, the subject claimed to be working for the KGB, but he's also claimed to be working with a mole. Playing the Americans for fools, in his words. On further questioning, he recanted all previous statements and refused to speak more. Uh, we're, we're seizing interruptions for the day to let him swat it, sweat it out and follow up some leads. Okay. The sound, do I hear that? Rescue Lucas Richter in the wall. Oh. Alley cat sneak undetected through the alleys in the brick in the brick in the wall. Be quiet. We don't want the locals writing this out. I agree. Then why is your not gun fucking silenced as well? <laughs> the fuck, man? Parks in the electronics store right across the street from Krause's place. I was gonna pick her up some networks from the bomb bar, but Damn, that sucks. Man, you are just, just a foodie too. And I respect that because I'm a foodie myself. Well, I try not to be, but you know. I was going to say that. Okay, well, before I do any of that, you guys are going to give me a second because I need to look around just to make sure. Oh, look, is it an arcade game? I can actually play the arcade game. What is that called? Enduro? I, well, I would, but not right now. A 
ledger. Okay. Right, I'll let it be known. I'll have to be careful. Move her body, move her body. Stage body. This is the briefcase. That's a purse, that's a phone. Gosh damn it, where is this fucking thing? Oh shit. Fuck. Ooh, evidence. Red circus. Okay, I might have to go through all this just to make sure I get all the evidence. Shut the fuck up, I'm trying to find it. There we go. Uh, 
Yes, but there are just photos here. Some kind of bomb. Oh, shit! Gosh damn it, cover blown. Damn. How long have you worked for Perseus? <laughs> Killing me gives you no room to negotiate with my friends. I don't know what the fuck he's shooting at. Thank you, Parker. Thank you. <laughs> uh, I was doing so well. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. I'm dead. How much does this have? 50? Okay, I got it. Anything in here? Oh, frag grenades. I'll take it. Oh, Jesus. Fuck it. Where's the AK? Where's the AK? Yo, give me the AK. Mop. 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 Jeez, I can't fucking see with this black outline. Holy shit. How do I fucking capture him? Mm. 
No, we're not doing that. Fuck off. We're capturing you. Kiss my ass. Oh, Park didn't do anything, but still. It doesn't matter. I got him. Got him. Mm. Red light, green light. Oh, are we just jumping? Wait, what? Oh, we're jumping straight into it. Oh, he wants me to go in the base? All right, bet. Lock picking system is a bit weird. Drop the body here. All right. So he said he was going to trail behind. I mean, someone's most likely going to definitely see the body. There's a bunch of, like, key cards. Holy shit, my frames, Jesus.
Every single one of these need a key card. I, I do not have a key card. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, that's a spotlight. Oh my god, enemy base PC killed. You don't engage heavy armor. I wasn't even. Oh, sure. Totally, I didn't even know about that. How the fuck was I supposed to know about that? Oh god, okay. Holy sh- Oh, well, they know now. I'm about to I'm about to do something really stupid. Don't worry. <laughs> what the fuck, Bill? <laughs> well, I can't help it, man. I wanted to hear that. Ooh. Yep. Oh, okay, I need to make sure I look around just to make sure I don't miss anything. But again, it doesn't look like I'm really missing much. Yep. Oh man, I'm so ready, man. I'm I'm shivering my, my timbers. Yeah, I'm covering. Go, man. Oh, you have a key card? God, this is probably going to be copyright. Yep. So while you're doing that, are they part of the drill? No, we fucking aren't. Oh. Shit. Jesus Christ, I'm just missing all my shots.
Boop, boop, bop. Oh God, I'm definitely gonna get copyright. I can already tell. Where? All right, just gonna reload my gun because that's what I need. That's what I need to do. Also, I'm sorry if I'm not talking a whole lot. Wow, I was about to execute the fucking. I was about to. Oh, wait. Oh, that was right next to me. Yep. Where the fuck is the sniper? Sniper was Where the fuck is the sniper? Is he dead? That tickles. I'm just camped out at the fucking buffet. Well, I'm gonna back up. Fucking hell. Oh shit. What the fuck? Fucking get him, Woods. Holy shit. It's over here. What? Oh shit! He's dead. Okay, they're all good. They are all KIA. I'll take it. All right, let's hit this button. I'm so She doesn't sound mad at all, man. Oh, by a few inches. Okay, at least give me a fucking second to look around. Oh, that's not meant to do.
I don't even think I'm supposed to do that. KGB updates. Uh, Operation Greenlight. I mean, I could try. Brezhnev? Bro, that's so dumb. <laughs> what the fuck? Hold on. Is my audio cut off? Oh, sorry, God. Hold on, give me one second. I'm gonna bring it back. Hold on. Let me just do this. Okay, do that. Okay. Sorry, I just gotta make sure I do this right now. Okay, there we go, much better. Um, print project green light. I'm grabbing a copy. This doesn't make any sense. Percy's infiltrated a CIA nuke program, codenamed Operation Greenlight, run by Hudson. The stolen nuke is American, and Hudson fucking knew. Uh oh. Shit. Time to go. I'm off right there. Hold on, I gotta make sure everything's good. Make sure everything's good. Okay, we gotta go. Park, come in. Park. Ooh, Magnum. I'm moving, I'm moving. Holy shit. Okay, yo, we are moving. We are moving our ass. Oh, fuck. fire I was woods I accidentally shot anyone else oh, I'm gonna assume we're good Hold on. 
fucker. Soviet heavy killed you there. Lethal at close range. Keep your distance. No shit. What do you think I was trying to do? Is there any more? The answer is yes. I want to say we're good, but then again, I don't know. Well, what now? Oh, we're entering the APC. Jesus Christ. If it dies, you move on. Hold on, Bell. I am holding on. All right, let's do it. Bell, watch that fucker coming up on our right. God damn it! Call the urban renewal, you Yes, sir, I'm on it. Red light, green light. Oh, I'm definitely gonna get copyright. You knew the nuke was from green light. Didn't tell us. What else are you hiding? Maybe I can knock the truth out of you. You might want to rethink that, Woods. Everybody stand down. This little pissing match isn't gonna help us catch Perseus. Why didn't you tell us it was an American nuke? He needed us to clean up his mess. The bastard's been lying to us all along. It's not a lie. It's an omission of fact. That's what you do best, isn't it, Hudson? Manipulate people. Tell them your own version of the truth. There is no truth. Only who you choose to believe. Adler knows all about that. Don't you, Russ? Operation Greenlight. What is it? Tell us everything. Back in 58, the arms race was in full swing. Eisenhower was convinced if the Reds moved on Europe, we couldn't respond quick enough. So he authorized Operation Greenlight. 
top secret program that placed nuclear bombs in every major European city. The ultimate countermeasure to a Soviet invasion. 74 of the bombs were upgraded to high yield neutron bombs, capable of terminating personnel without damaging infrastructure. Thousands dying in a flash. And you're talking about fucking infrastructure. How's that for civilized? We kill the people, but preserve the buildings. We're trying to preserve our way of life. How long have you known about the missing nuke? One of the green light nukes went offline eight weeks ago. We suspected it was Perseus, but couldn't confirm it. So we saw the photos you brought back from East Berlin. So, there's an American-made nuke in the wild. And once Perseus detonates it, the United States becomes global enemy number one. We wouldn't have this problem if you'd done your job. Killed Perseus in Vietnam. Careful, Hudson. Next time, I might not stop Woods. Ooh. We need to know what Perseus is planning for that nuke. Park? Anything else in that printout Bell and Woods pulled from the base? There's mention of an excavation taking place in the Ural Mountains, Yamantau. Our insider within the KGB confirmed an active operation. Yamantau. I thought Hudson and Weaver buried that place years ago. We oh, that place. Perseus wants to salvage the old mainframe. Dragovich and Steiner must have left some good shit behind. Steiner. Send me in Woods. You're too close to this, Mason. We can afford zero fuck-ups. Bullshit. You know there's no one better for that job. Fuck It's Dragovich. Steiner. I want Mason and Woods on this. He's Find that mainframe before must Perseus die. Dies. I'll contact our KGB insider, Belikov. He'll offer logistical support. Hell, Belikov may want to fly the chopper himself. Whatever Perseus wants at Yamantau, I want it more. Don't tell me we're jumping straight into a mission again. Gosh damn it. Okay. Alright, so unfortunately, I'm going to have to end the stream right there because they're already at the two hour mark. Um, it's like fucking um i mean it's already past midnight so with that being said um i will be playing this cold war campaign now you're probably wondering why am i playing the cold war campaign well it's a simple reason for that being and it's because of the fact that uh this shit takes so much of my fucking storage i'm not even kidding it takes 30 percent of my storage so that's why i want to play the campaign and then just hopefully uninstall it at that point um, I know there's two endings. I will be doing those endings. I know which endings those are. I know which ending I would have definitely preferred. Which is probably the ending that I'm probably going to pick first. And then the true ending is going to be the second one. Because that will just be a good way to just, you know, end, you know, campaign of Cold War. So, with that being said, um, I think we might be able to finish this through this week. I do not know. But with that being said, I hope to see you all... Next time, tomorrow, I th think I'm going to do tomorrow. Am I going to do tomorrow? I probably will do tomorrow. So, yeah, I'll, I'll stream tomorrow. Otherwise, I probably won't be streaming on, like, fucking Saturday or Friday. I don't know. Just depends. Um, so, with that being said, hope you all enjoyed. And hope to see you all next time for the next Cold Out War campaign. I just realized something. Since Black Ops 6 is going to happen and Woods' legs is basically just decommissioned, I guess that means Hudson is dead, technically speaking. But anyways, with that being said, I am sorry for that. I've delayed it too long. I will see you all next time. Peace out, everyone. See you on Tuesday. Wait, Tuesday? Yeah, yeah see you on Tuesday. Peace out.